Salt and Simon. You okay? Good mate. Just listening to that you know little secret. This is my go to um motivation. The Mulligan brothers and Muhammad Ali. I like Jordan's voice. It gets me very emotional actually, so I'll stop listening because I'll start crying. Um so we are <clears throat> the day of the first day of the heats of World's Strongest Man. Just want to say one more thing and thank you to <coughs> Told you. Jeez so oh. um one minute. No, I've just been listening to motivational stuff and it gets me kind of pumped up. So I'm, that's what happens when you see me wearing my glasses. Um, so when I'm wearing those glasses, I get very emotional. It gets really built up. Obviously, with what happened yesterday, all the support you guys are showing, it means an awful lot to me. It really does. Um, just proves don't let f***ing bullies, don't let bullies ruin things that you do that enjoy your life. That's the thing. That's all I'm going to say on that. Um, today is the most important day, or today is the start of the most important days of our lives, and I am beyond fired up today. I can't wait to get out there. We've just ordered breakfast. Um, Tom's going early. Tom's up in the first group. He's going to smash the load in. I'm going to go and smash the load in. Um, I am. I'm ready to go. You know, this is. <sighs> prep's been amazing. Training's been amazing great to have everyone out here again um, there's going to be a big crowd there today and yeah I can't wait to go so now it's what time are we on now it's 5.53 in the morning out here in America um, so I've ordered food I'm going to get up, have some of my supplements to take, some hydration stuff, make sure I'm nice and hydrated, get my bag ready um, and then 8.48 um, we get the bus down to to battle it out to see um, basically who's going to be world's strongest man so this is why we do this sport this is the the pinnacle of everything that we do this is our Olympics, this is our World Cup our, our Super Bowl, our, our everything so this is it today and yeah, I'm trying to contain as much as I can at the moment but it's... Uh, like my emotions, everyone knows I think that I'm an emotional guy with my heart in my sleeve. When I'm happy, I'm happy. When I'm sad, I'm sad. And when I'm excited, I get emotional as well. So, yeah, I'm super excited. So stay tuned and we'll try and show you as much as we can. What events is it today? So events, we have loading first. That consists of five implements. We have a, a stone, a keg, an anvil and two sandbags. And then we go to the deadlift ladder later on today. That ranges from 300 to 380 kilos. So 300, 320, 340, 360, 380. So yeah, that's the two events we have today. Get them done. Smash them. Go on to a good place tomorrow. And then smash tomorrow. And smash the next day. And smash the final. And that's the plan. That's all we have to do. But every guy that's in this call this competition is absolutely impeccable you know we've got some amazing athletes here so yeah whoever wins the world's strongest man this year is the the world's strongest man it's very simple that's the that's the exciting thing for me this year is that you know the lineup is stacked the lineup is so so stacked so that's all I want to do is go up against the best guys in the world and this last However long I've been been trained, I've been training since I was 16. That's all led up to this moment in my life. So I get to go and do that, which is which is good. I'm really excited for. How are you feeling, big boy? Hi guys, I'm very good. I heard you choked on a pancake this morning. That was actually. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> What'd you get? I'm not having these ones because there's too much. But I, have, I hop. Pan four pancakes with loads of chocolate chips, syrup, strawberries. I don't think I've had ate food at six a.m. in the morning for a long, long time. Everybody, open your mouth up when you see this food coming. 
What's your schedule today, Tom? Unfortunately, I have to lift weights today, and I really cannot be arsed. I'm still in the dancing kind of mood, you know? For me, it's 8 o'clock. I'm in group one, so that's why 6 a.m. in the morning eating this much food is weird, but yeah, I can't wait. Uh, I just want to say a quick shout out to Pa, you know, um, I... Sorry, <laughs> I had to start that again. I was trying to do a nice message. But yeah, so a big shout out to Pa, obviously, you know, I think people found out last night on social media and stuff that he's been pulled out with an injury. I'm gutted for him, you know, we're in the same group together, we, we have some really good banter and are really good friends, have come really good friends in the sport, so I'll be a massive shout out to Pa. You know, he'll come back stronger for this. Hopefully he'll go home after this and just you know, get his health sorted and uh, get his injuries sorted and uh, look after himself and then come back stronger. But then also a big massive shout out to Andy Black. I was sitting with Andy Black last night, just before he got announced, he was just going back up to his room and then he got announced that he was coming, so another free Scotsman in, in, the, in the World Strongest Man is great to see. So yeah, big shout out to Andy. 6 a.m. So this is breakfast for me. And the Nathan's coming up to do my glucose levels in like half an hour. It's basically a wee prick, and you put it into your finger and put it into the machine. And my glucose levels should be about between 240 to 260. So when he came, when he came and did them last night for me the first time, over 230. That's a bit low. If I compete at that, I'll just crash. So then that's why he did that because then my next two meals after that were for getting the glucose levels up. That's exactly why I had a Chinese, my first ever Chinese in America was last night. And then my last meal was pasta. Usually I have burgers, but I had the Chinese, had the lasagna, then he came back up to my room about a quarter to 10 or something, tested it and it was at 243, which is perfect kind of, the perfect uh, range it should be in. So he's coming back up today after I have my pancakes and see what it's at. So yeah, it's really good having Nathan here. Cause you know, if he wasn't here, it would have just been a guest game and I can't get, you know, to 100% to a T. Yeah, it's good over text and stuff, but because he's actually physically here, he can do all these wee tests to you, which gives you that extra 2 or 3%. But, yeah, I, I start at 8 a.m. today, so I so she's just eating this, doing my loading, then I've got deadlifts, then I come back, I sleep, and then that's it. Just packing my bag, just a quick thing to mention at World Strongest Man. So this year, there is all different chalks out there, but we're only allowed to use magnesium and alcohol-based products. This is my My Protein Liquid Chalk that I use. It is just chalk. That's what Worlds have asked us. So there's other, uh, other chalks out there that have like, additional ingredients in it, which is really good, I'm not going to lie. But unfortunately, you know, Worlds have made the decision to... And I, I can see it because I guess it's not technically chalk, right? Um, if you're adding tacky and stuff in it. So it's just the block chalk or liquid chalk just with magnesium and alcohol. So I'm just packing my bag at the moment. So I've got my, my bands for warm up. I've got my two different types of belts, knee sleeves, my stinking deadlift suit, two elbow sleeves. Yep, check. I'll push you got with some gloves. Just in case you decide to use them, they're really good gloves actually. I think I'll just go normal hands, that's what I normally do, even in the hot countries. And I've got some big briefs, and obviously, as you all know, it wouldn't be a world's strongest man without my horrible blue neoprenes, with a lot of rain bars there. I've got new ones, but I just, I don't know about anyone else there, but like superstition and stuff like that coming to I just, I'm used to, used to wearing them. Oh, that's pretty much it. Obviously my Oakleys, once these come on, that's when it's oh, I can't put money. <laughs> um, so yeah, once they come on, that's, uh, that's exciting. My body's quite sensitive, so I need to do a little bit more of a substantial kind of load up. So that's why we have pancakes, we've got that starchy food, that kind of spikes everything up quite high for me. So I need to get that up quite high this morning. Um, so eat quite a bit, then when we're there, Nathan will kind of load me up before we go out and do the loading race, same with the deadlifts. Worlds is different because you have to, there's quite a long time in between events, so we'll get down to the venue, I don't know, nine-ish or so, and we're not competing until it's like 10, 48, so we've got a couple hours to kind of wait down there. What happens in that time between? Because it's a TV show, there's a lot of kind of, Cameras moving, sets to be set up. You know, it's Giants Live. It's very, 
you know, it's very smooth, it's very kind of boom, 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 boom. It's, it's, a, it's a strongman show, this is more of a TV show. People at Worlds need to make sure that it's all done properly and rightly for the TV and all that good stuff. So then we finish, I think we break for lunch, then we come back later on for deadlift. I think it's like three o'clock I'm deadlifting t uh, today, so. Which will be nice, it's probably going to be one of the hottest days today. Up to about 38 degrees today, which is nice and hot. But I'll just make sure my legs are sweating profusely so it's nice and slippy for that deadlift bar. Right, you know you get guests of sweeties in a jar. How many strawberries are in that tub? Prize is absolutely f all. <laughs> what, what do you think, Sinead? Um, 32. 31. 31. 32. 30. 30. 31. 32. 31. Oh, what did you say? 42. 33. <laughs> 46. 46. You're the Earlier on, you know, it was nice. They, they asked all the athletes. So we got like a a team photo in front of the Capitol building um, out here in Sacramento, so that was pretty cool. It was really hot, <laughs> we were all sweating, but yeah, it was good fun, it was nice. And it's something that we can kind of look back in years to come, reminisce about it all, see all the guys, there's some, every athlete here is amazing, you know, and um, really, uh, really special to be here with all these great guys. How'd they go? I was too tummy. I had to eat pancakes at suits there. My blood glucose levels was eight times the amount it was meant to be. Was it? Yeah. So you know, last night it was last night it was low. It went spiked, so I had to stop eating pancakes. <laughs> and it was 8 a.m. in the morning. I'm lifting weights. I can't be harsh to that. Like Jesus. <laughs> 8 a.m. in the morning. You feeling alright? Yeah, I feel good. I had a brisk bit. Brisk. Brisket. 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 Bris brisket. Brisket. The steak stuff. They were nice. And barbecue yes. sauce. Hey, buddy. <laughs> yeah, good. So, loading the event out of the way. That's probably like the one I was going to lose most points on. So, yeah. I was happy to kind of get f on that. We're we'll going to deadlift and try and claw a few points back. So, yeah. And obviously, you found out last night, didn't you? Yeah, like, like literally. Buzzing, buzzing. Oh, man. He told, Colin told us at like. 8 o'clock last night and I was like just rushing about trying to pack my bag Where's my elbow sleeves? Yeah, <laughs> yeah no, that was amazing You're poking around with, uh, with the heat and stuff Yeah, it seems okay, the, the athlete's tent's obviously mint yeah. Full of aircon and everything, so yeah, not too bad The stinkiest fish in the world me, It's one of the funniest videos we've watched It's amazing <laughs> <laughs> These two watched it, they want to try yeah. smelling it But, but do, do you know what, Tom actually eats that guy in a sandwich No, he doesn't Would you guys like a little photo? Yeah, go on. Can I get a family one and I'll hold the camera? Yeah, can you? Hold the phone. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Come on, you got it's this. It's nice to be here. Big Kelvin in my group, the big Dutchman. Yeah. Uh, he's really good at loading, so I kind of knew I had to... Yeah, yeah he's the... right on the road. Yeah, 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 so... No, it was good. Yeah, very happy with the first event. You know yourself, it's only one event in, so... Yeah, yeah. But that's the important one, because you want to take the stress off as early as possible yes. and you relax. And yeah. Better when you're not under pressure. 100%, 100%. Yeah, no, it was good. Um, everyone put in a good show, some really fast times. <laughs> We're out here in California. How did Event 1 go, Danny boy? Yeah, decent, not bad. Cut. <laughs> <laughs> really good, really good first event for the lads. First event, World's Strongest Man's always a bit of a tense one. Tom went out there, absolutely dominated. So I've had a little bit of time to chill while the other groups went, and then Luke came out, showed sort of his character as an athlete uh, by supporting Evan Singleton whilst he was having a bit of trouble, and won his group. It's a pretty perfect start. We're going to get some coffee, and then we are going to win a deadlift event, go home, chill out, easy, ready to go again tomorrow. You're allowed in the tent, aren't you? Yeah, I do. What what, the what's the I'm atmosphere like here? Is it tense? It's very much like a tent. <laughs> you could say it's intense. <laughs> <laughs> what do I think of the event overall in terms of like the boys or? Uh, really cool, yeah. We're quite close to the action as well, so that's really good. Exciting. To be honest, beyond beyond uh, Luke and Tom, we, we can't really focus on anything else. Like, it's, it's really intense. So, uh, Tom and Luke, uh, really good. I'm buzzing. Top of the groups. Um, 
Tom put in a nice casual performance and got one of the better times and Luke came in with some intensity and put in one of the best times I believe and uh, smashed it. So I'm happy man. Uh, great great start to the day. Yeah. Good job Luke. You good? Nobody's stopping you. Oh no, baby. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. Awesome. 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 Thank guys. you. Thanks for coming out guys. Cheers. Thank you. What's up, Simon? What's up, guys? So, two events done today. They went pretty well. I'm happy. Tomorrow's a good day. The log press, car walk. I'm happy. Big shout out to Evan. Unfortunately, Evan got injured today and had to pull out. So, um, speedy recovery to, to you, Evan. I know you're looking forward to making the final. And I'm sure you would have done him. You know, been a huge contender for the title. Um, but I'm sure we'll have plenty more battles. Stay safe, dinosaur. My little T-Rex friend. I love you. Thank you off you. Yeah, awesome day. Huge shout out to everyone. Cushy, Dan, Nathan. Well done to Big Tommy as well. He had an awesome day. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I told you this was a fire. It's not a fire, it's like a volcano that's erupting in me at the moment. So thank you for allowing me to perform at the best I have ever performed. I'll see you on that podium. What are you saying, bud? Lightweight. <laughs> Day one, bro. Day one, world's strongest man. Completed it, bro. Um, so it was a good day. Um, again, only two events in, you know, so still got another four events to go. Well, hopefully not four, but we'll see, see how things progress. Yeah, a really solid performance, and I'm quite proud of myself today, how I performed. Now, especially with whatever, doesn't matter. But yeah, it's just happy with. The, the performance, um, excited to get out there and do the job tomorrow again, you know, it's, um, you could have seen I was quite emotional this morning, and I'm usually like that, you know, I usually get quite emotional, I'm quite an emotional person when I'm competing, because, you know, I do a lot of, kind of, you know, thinking about mum and stuff and all the rest of it, so it kind of gets me, it gets me, so, yeah, really happy, really chuffed. Um, just gonna have some food, do some recovery, got physio, Kushi's just the way down to book me into physio. Yeah, got something else to eat later on tonight as well, so yeah, really good. So, quite happy with how today went. Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed it. We can't show you and we can't release any results obviously, but I'm sure you know anyway. I just wanted to say a little shout out to, you know, some of the guys that had a bit of a, a bit of a bad time. You know, Pa, our, our good friend Pa Dwyer, unfortunately, um, had to withdraw from the competition um, so we're sending him our love we were speaking to him he's okay you know Paz had a great season so far I'm sure he's gonna he's gonna carry on smashing it so big shout out to him our uh, buddy Evan as I've said you know Evan is such a nice guy Evan's a great guy and he, he trains so hard I know he, he put his heart and soul into this and um, my heart goes out and I hope you really do recover quick Evan and you know we're really looking forward to doing battles with you in the future um, I'm wishing you a speedy recovery a um, couple of other guys had some niggles I believe Shane dropped an anvil on his foot or something so I hope Shane can you know push on fingers crossed um, but unfortunately that's a sport you know that's a sport we, we get injured we kind of push on um, and it's just a just a battle, you know, it's a battle just to stay in this and um, yeah, so that's that, so got to chill, up, chill out today, tomorrow we have car walk and log press so let's see how that goes and we'll speak to you tomorrow Day one done and dusted, yes it was good I was confident going into the loading, I was confident going into the deadlift I don't really get too excited with the qualifiers, obviously it's good to be first place but I'm not going to get over, you know, over excited. I'm trying to not use as much energy. And my highs have not really had to work as hard as some other groups. You know, my loading wasn't as fast because it didn't need to be as fast. My deadlift didn't need to be as fast. You know, no one had completed five bars before me. I knew I just had to complete all five bars and do it in the, you know, quickest time. And I did that. So, yeah, two events down, and and it's nice and easy. You know, so saying I'm trying to just coast, uh, coast through the qualifier, get there injury free to the final then that's when I can turn it up a gear, but yeah, so far so good. We're on to day two tomorrow, which again is car walk and uh, 
football press. Again, I need to. Um, I think I'm three points clear, so I can just finish. You know, the car walk in top two, and then even log top two, and I know it's been basically qualified. So I'll, again, I'll do some hard work tomorrow, or maybe up a, up one gear tomorrow, and then Thursday will be a chilled out day. Then we get the final on Saturday, Sunday. But yeah, all good, injury free, and I feel good. What was your highlight of the day, mate? The highlight of today for me was obviously performing the best I could do, going away injury free, and not having to really get out of second or third gear. How are you coping with the heat? Yeah, heat's good. I love this. I love the heat. I mean, <laughs> being from Scotland, it's weird, but I don't really get too sweaty. I stay out the heat as much as I can, and I prefer to to um, compete when it's hot and stuff as well. I think it's because I don't have to warm up as much. My muscles are warm. They're not cold. They're not, I'm not kind of thinking about getting injured when I'm if it's you know cold and stuff as well but yeah everything's like i said so far so good everything's been ticked hopefully the same tomorrow hopefully i can you know i'm, I'm last in the car walk again as well so i see see what happens you know there if i can come top two in that then we start the log off with a winner in the log and that's me basically through so yeah all going plan same again tomorrow then boom job done hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you for your support stay safe smile and stay spicy and please don't forget to ring that little bell and ding a ling a ling a ling, -a -ling.